everyone and welcome back to another video of Pokemon Brothers Cards and today we're going to be reviewing one of my mystery boxes and of course we will be opening the packs inside and of this mystery box is mine I have created it but this box is a mystery box I did get my first ever mystery box from Care Park who is definitely in my opinion the best mystery box buyer to get and I, this mystery actual the actual box is from her i have put a little bit of more tape to seal it up so let's get right on into it but this the stuff inside is from my mystery boxes and hopefully very soon you'll be able to find this uh, mystery box on ebay it will probably have the sign of pokemon brothers cards mystery box because otherwise it will just look like a normal mystery box so you get to know how what it is i'm just gonna i'm just doing this on the side so it doesn't take as long to open it up sorry about this guys it might take a few seconds out of your time but i'd like to know how your week and your weekend was at the time of this recording it is Sunday the 12th of January 2020 so happy new year guys I hope you enjoyed uh, Christmas and December and all of your presents and I hope you got some really nice ones right let's get into my mystery box right so first you can pull out some most of the time these are in my mystery boxes but unscanned code cards there's another one forbidden light and a guardian's rising and then i won't open these these are just some custom packs and most of the time they have they have regular rares sometimes gx's and um they also have reverses as well and over here we have a gx tag team marker this one is the plastic one sometimes you can get this metal one from the tag team tins but that one is just from um the Cosmic Clips Elite Trainer Box. So let's pull this stuff out. In there is a lot of little bits in my mystery boxes. So you get a keychain here. Some of you, the OG fans, will remember uh, the these keychains. These are from the uh, the other setup over there. But there's a lot of little figures and figures and everything. So you also get a bracelet there in pretty much every mystery box. You also get a bunch of figures i'll grab all of them out and then i can read you out all the names all right so you got now i think this is a spinder i'm not 100 percent sure because it doesn't sometimes they look a bit off and then here you got a monferno you got a dugong there you guys go here dugong electabuzz Meowth, Mantine, or Mantine, Pikachu, you got a Toracle as well, here, you got a Mill Tank, they will all be different, and maybe one mystery box I think has got two Pikachus in, but I'll try and sort that out, a Minium, Totodile, um, Pansage, I think, uh, Litleo, and a dealing so there is quite a lot of figures in there oh there's a few more here we've got a machop and an electric a gray electric uh yeah okay and most of the time you get three coins included in these mystery boxes so you get a kamoo coin here uh, a nine tails coin and a guard trump coin but they'll all be different there'll be no duplicates so let's get into the packs but this is not all guys it will probably be roughly around 35 to 40 pounds but i'll do show you all the packs and it depends it can be bigger like this one i've got here different box my box it's got i think it's got eight packs and like 20 figures and other stuff as well and one one of the, probably the most main attractions is a psa card now with this one we've got a psa 8 mystery and they will not be below seven but they will always be um above seven, seven or higher all right let's get right on into it all right so 
in this we get guardians rising steam siege evolutions and shining legends we will be opening the shining legends um but yeah they're pretty good to pack let pack selection steam siege not so great in other people's opinion but in my opinion it's a good set but the, these three sets are absolutely brilliant so let's get right on into the steam siege hopefully we pull something because if we don't it's probably not how most of my mystery boxes are going to go because they um i don't weigh the packs but hopefully not all of them will get green codes right pack over there Aha, there we go. White and green co. That's a good start. One, two, three from the back. The front. Don't guess the energy because there isn't one. Rapidash, Persian, Greedy Dice, Shellos, Krogunk, Tangela, Clink, Joltik, Lavestia, and a Yevetal Ye Hollow. And these are all 100% sealed packs. Nice Yevetal Hollow or Yevetal. Right. There you go. Put the common cards there. Right, next we'll go into evolutions. The un the best I've ever done in evolutions is a hollow, so hopefully it's Apollo GX. This is from a Tapu Coco or Tapu Bulu tin, but because I did get two Blastoise artworks. Right, come on. Evolutions. Full green code. Most of the time it'll just be one X and Y set, and it'll probably not be Steam Siege. But um, most the rest of the packs will be sun and moon, right? Uh, an energy, a marchoke, coughing, tangula, pronita, doduo, staryu, st uh, seal. Oh, dog trio reverse rare. So it's going quite well, and <laughs> and a regular rare dog trio. So dog trio reverse, quite quite a nice card. So so far the mystery box is going quite well, right? Oh. I also got this um, blister pack booster box, and I've got four blister packs in there so far. So hopefully, it will um, add up over the next few weeks, months, or years. Right, Guardians Rising. I haven't opened one of these packs in a very, very long time. Right, full green code. Still could pull a prism though. Three, four. I'm getting better at the card trick. Electric. Dark energy, alrighty. Dark energy. Clefable. Su Glysaur. Hakamoo. Rubbish. Machop. Alolan Geodude. Mudbray. Alolan Sandshrew. Enhanced Hammer. And a Trevenant. Regular Rare. So, Shining Legends time. Hopefully, you can pull it a Shiny um, Volcanion or Arceus. Or a GX. Probably, I'd like to pull. Uh, this is my first time ever opening a Shining Legends pack. Right, I think they're all white and green codes. Yes, I do believe so. Here you go. Shining Legends. Oh, dropped the code card. There's always something that drops in one of my videos. Four, I do believe, because it's Sun and Moon. If there's an energy, electric. Okay, metal. Damage mover. Ball, Corona. For Relegator, both really nice looking cards. So I'll keep those up to a side. Jinx, Scraggy, Shroomish, Quallfish, Stunkfish. <gasps> yes! Oh, yes. Venusaur Reverse Uncommon, which should be a rare in my opinion. And a Marshadow Hollow Rare. Oh, in my opinion, this has been the best mystery box. Wow, so we've got... Well, not as good as Care Park, but it's definitely a very good one. So we've got Venusaur Reverse, two Hollows, a regular uh, regular Red Dog Trio, and two gorgeous-looking Volcarona and Ferelegators. So if you did enjoy today's video, I hope you did because it's absolutely been great. And if you are interested in buying any of my mystery boxes, they will be coming up on eBay soon. So please go and try and find one because probably in the next week or so, um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.